Hi beautiful angels. Welcome to the Divine Guidance by Renu. My name is Renu and I'm a tutor tarot reader. Today I brought you a very quick small reading. So we would know just a one thing we're going to talk about that would totally change your life or it will bring the big transformation in your life. So I have a six pile to choose. So you can pause the video, you can choose intuitively and or do the meditation. And I just want to say thank you, thank you, thank you so much for all of my subscribers. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much for your positive comments. Thank you so much. Uh, I have a few requests uh, to do some uh, pick a card readings, some ideas. So I will definitely take care of them in the near future. So thank you, thank you, thank you so much for all, for all of your liking, sharing and subs subscribers. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. So let's start with your reading. So uh, we will start with the pile one. So let me quickly uh, remove the rest of the piles. So hi pile one. Let's start with your reading. So what is that one thing that would change you would know uh, that can change your life or it could bring a big transformation in your life so what could be that one thing so it is a queen of swords so what I feel uh, somebody is making queen of sword uncomfortable as you can see her face it's a bit uncomfortable anxious or maybe she's um, getting affected by somebody's energy from her environment, like toxic energy. So she, need, you need to become a queen of swords. You need to clear your energy, clear your aura, clear your environment. And it could be clearing your thoughts. So swords is also about the thought. So it could be like recently because of some reasons you are mentally disturbed or you're thinking too much or thinking negatively uh, please change it change your perspective to see the things start thinking positive if you want to manifest all your wishes so you have to start thinking positive and one more thing I could see it over here if you want any communication with that toxic person in your life uh, you need to do that. You need to address your needs. You need to address that. Uh, you're not liking their energy. You need to clear their, your energy. You need to, you know, cut all the codes from the toxic energies, from the toxic people. And you're becoming independent, taking care of your own castle, protecting yourself, guarding yourself. So becoming queen of swords would change your life pile one it will bring a big transformation in your life be the leader of your own life she's very independent she knows who to cut down from her life she knows that who is not serving her who has a toxic energy so she is so she's cutting the cards codes Addressing your needs and communicating about it is not a bad thing. You should go for that. So let's see where the angel guidance over here. Fresh air. Your body needs refreshment from oxygenated air generated by grass, trees, plants, and flowers. Spend time outside today as near to Mother Nature's cradle as possible. Open your curtains and windows to refresh your home as well. So very beautiful energy. Uh, the angels are asking you to also clear your energy. 
you can go spend time in your nature you can clear your mind connect with the nature that would be healing and refreshing for you or if you're indoor person then open your windows and let that stagnant energy out of your house so very beautiful let's take one um, hidden truth to close the reading old accumulated anger blocks the connection with the divine so yeah so she might be holding anger or resentment towards this person in her life who had causes her too much pain so that's what you have to uh, address that your anger towards that person you have to uh, communicate about it and let that energy go release it and that also blocking your connection with the divine forgive yourself forgive the people let that anger go release the energy release that toxic energy let the, release the people toxic people so that you can make a connection with the divine if you are just working on yourself and trying to make that connection with the divine so thank you thank you thank you so much pile one if it does resonate with you please 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 like share and subscribe to my channel and turn on the bell icon so yeah so that you don't miss any notification from all of my upcoming videos and let me know in the comment section which pile resonate with you thank you thank you thank you so much so let's move on to the pile two hi pile two welcome to the reading and let's start with your uh, reading that what is that one thing that it would change your life or bring a big transformation in your life you have to make that change or universe is sending in your way so that you i'm the messenger i'm giving you that message for that change so you can address that sign of change and also mindfully take the action towards it to change your life so the lovers so who is this person you might not be trusting that much uh, that person or universe but this card is over here the angels are showing you this is a heavenly made relationship or union for you this person would change your life in a very positive positive way that would help you grow emotionally mentally spiritually so as you can see there are lots of green color over here that will bring a lot of growth a lot of happiness it is your true love so go for that trust that trust angels trust the universe trust this union trust this relationship so you might be thinking of getting married with this person or you're already married not trusting that so please 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 trust that this is a divine love this is a soul connection this is a twin flame so let's see angel guidance card over here notice the signs yes the signs you have been receiving are heaven sent we draw feathers coins and other signs upon your path to remind you that you are loved and never alone very 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 beautiful you see that both of the cards have an angel here so you can notice that please if you seen these kind of signs notice that address that sign this is reminding you that you are loved you're never alone so last card from hidden truth uh, which will to close the reading so from this day on all the excuses that served you as escape from happy fulfillment are cancelled so if you are not trusting that's why this card is over here that this is a real fulfillment this relationship is a real fulfillment this is a happy fulfillment so if you were thinking negatively or thinking oh it's not happening it is not there is no person that would make keep you happy that love you truly at a soul level but this is a clear sign to you this is the person all the excuses that served you as escape from happy fulfillment are cancelled why cancelled because 
those are happy fulfillment are coming for you through this person so thank you thank you thank you so much pile two please if it resonate with you please 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 let me know in the comment section and like share and subscribe to my channel and turn on the bell icon so you get all the notifications from my channel so thank you thank you thank you so much let's move on to the pile three hi pile three welcome to the reading uh what is that one thing that would change your whole life or it could bring big transformation in your life so uh it could be any sign or any uh any message that i'm giving you through universe universe is giving you through me so that you can take action towards it to make that change that you longing for that you're looking for okay what is the first card over here eight of wands eight of wands if you see that those it is definitely a message coming to you that will be very unexpected message and coming re really fast and you know that eight of wands energy is really really quick energy very fast energy it is coming to you very soon so you have to address that it could be any message phone call from your friends from your relatives from your uh, parents from your family it could be any message that is given to you you have to address that message then I clarify that what is this message is about and I got the seven of swords so this is messages about the person in your mind that about his or her about their deception their manipulation their lies definitely somebody is lying you manipulating you at your back and you don't even know that so that a message is coming to you through some person very soon so that you can make positive change related to that person if you're thinking of getting married get engaged with that person think again if you get this message so pay attention to that message what is it about whom is it about so you can make purposely mindfully you can make the changes in your life don't uh don't get upset don't uh get angry just be positive think that this is a good sign before something would happen you know that so that you can make the changes so what is the angel guidance over here trustworthy guidance you have received a wonderful idea as an answer to your prayers this idea is real and trustworthy you can safely move forward with it knowing that we are with you every step of the way ask for and be open to receiving our support for anything that you need related to this idea again this is again a guidance is coming a message is coming and you can see that or somebody is writing to you and you can see that uh, the message is over here tied to her leg bird's leg so again you can ask for the guidance from the angels if you have any doubt about it but it's it's helping it's coming so that you can take action you can safely move forward with it so let's see to close the reading let's see the, what is the hidden truth message for you your progressive ideas are ahead of their time other people do not have the capacity to understand you right now so i think what is what comes in my head that is a frequency or something that if your frequency doesn't match with that person so whatever you thinking about this person that doesn't match they don't understand you right now 
Other people do not have the capacity to understand you right now. So take it what resonates and leave it what doesn't. And if you like the content, please like, share and subscribe to my channel. So let's move on to the pile four now. Hi pile four. Welcome to the reading. So let's see what is that one thing that would change your life. Or it bring any, uh, this reading bring any message to you so that you can purposely make that change in your life. So the first card over here, the moon. What I can see, uh, she's holding two bouquets over here. So what I feel that uh, your, your psychic abilities are increasing these days uh, and you are having a lot of dreams so it is happening during your dream time during your sleep time so whenever you have a dream please write it down in the journal so it would keep coming and bring clarity for you it keep growing and growing your psychic abilities um, and another thing what I can see that that this bouquet has all the red flowers in here so I think that somebody uh, your partner or romantic partner is coming into your life it could be both of them coming to you towards you that would change your life so if you are opening to your psychic gifts please share them with the world help with these gifts so that it can keep growing and growing so when you have spiritual gifts that is only for sharing sharing the world healing the world raising their vibes so you also raise your wife. So let's see the angel guidance over here. The new partner. A chance meeting is no mistake. It is divinely orchestrated as a catalyst to set the wheels in motion for the fruition of your prayers. Pay careful attention to new people we send into your life. You will recognize them by your sense of familiarity, comfort and safety. Yeah, definitely. So look for the sign watch for this person who is this person excuse me that is coming to your life so that is could be your new partner true love or um, twin flame so as i said that it could be one thing for few per people and it could be both of them so that's what is happening that would change your life so this new partner will bring a lot of change in your life that I what I can feel that that is a totally heavenly sent partner so that you can grow emotionally mentally and spiritually with this partner so very very beautiful so let's see what is the hidden truth to close the reading uh, at this moment you have everything you need very beautiful so what you wishing for you were wishing for starting something spiritually or looking for spiritual gifts opening to the spiritual gift or longing for the new partner that's coming so you have everything you need so very beautiful pile four so thank you, thank you, thank you so much. If it resonates with you, please let me know in the comment section. And please like, share and subscribe to my channel. And turn on the bell icon so you don't miss any notification. So this thing, that will totally change your life. This is coming in your way, the new partner or the psychic abilities. That would definitely transform your life in a very good way. So let's move on to the pile five. Hi, pile five. So what is that one thing, pile five, that would totally change your life or it can bring a message for you, this reading, so that you can be mindful, notice that sign, that message and bring yourself that change in your life. Bring that big transformation that you're looking for. Okay, so the first card over here is the hermit. So the hermit is here. 
that I think you are looking for some answers. You are on your spiritual journey. You are looking for some answers. So the message over here is that you have to go inward to find out that answer. All the answers are hiding inside. So go inward for soul searching. It will help you healing, finding the light within you, not outside it, within you. So connect to your soul, your higher self, do some meditation. The answers will come to you. The clarity will come to you. So connect with your higher self. And also, uh, this darkness will go away. So you will get all the clarity. Once you connect with the higher self, you will start getting all kind of clarity. You will get answers for all of your questions. And what I can feel that over here, he looks like also a guru. So once you find that inner light, you would also help the other people to see their light with this lantern here. You will definitely use this lantern, this knowledge, your experiences, your wisdom to show their path. To help them see their path. Raise their vibration. Help the people. So thank you, thank No, 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 no. Sorry, sorry, sorry. There is an angel guidance card over here. Release and slender. surrender. We shower you with the blessings of our radiant love. Open your arms and release the challenges that you have held tightly gripped within your hands. Open your hands, arms and heart to our love and assistance. So I think you should connect with the, your heart chakra. Connecting with the heart chakra, opening the heart chakra, you will be able to connect with the higher energy, with the angels. So that would also, your angel guides, your spirit guides, sorry, your angels, archangels, masters that would also bring the light and bring uh, clarity in your life so open your heart to love and assistance ask for that it will come to you definitely it come to you so that's what one thing that would change your life so let's see let's see the last uh, hidden truth card to close the reading so sincere and direct communication that comes from your heart will solve many problems and open emotional blockages yeah so if you have emotional blockages also if you will work on your heart you will open the emotional blockages also will be able to connect to your higher self with the angel with the higher being so that you can get the clarity you can ask them, say loud to your angels that you want the answer for this question. You're looking for that. What you, where you need the clarity? Ask for that. It will come to you definitely. Ask loud. Say it. Sincere and direct communication that comes from your heart will solve many problems. So that is the one thing doing in our search opening your heart connecting to angels your higher self will bring you the clarity and it will bring you the guidance that will solve so many of your problems that would change your life so thank you thank you thank you so much pile five if you like it please like share and subscribe to my channel and turn on bell icon so you don't miss any notification for all of my upcoming videos thank you thank you thank you so much thank you for watching so let's move on to the pile six the last pile hi pile six so what is that one thing pile six that would change your life or it will this reading will provide you a message that you address that message and purposely mindfully you make that change in your life or so to 
to transform your life in a positive way so let's see what is that message here we go so queen of pentacles queen of pentacles is working so hard she, she's so ambitious she's so um financially stable because she's hard working so uh over here you must be working so much but not taking care of yourself so the message is over here what can change your life self-love you need to love yourself you need to spend time money energy on yourself make yourself happy that would heal your life and also that will bring a big transformation in your life so uh, get a massage get your nails done get your hair done do whatever you want to make yourself happy to bring a big smile on your face do that spend that money on yourself love yourself give yourself some hugs give yourself some pat on your back for such a hard work taking big responsibilities in your life making everybody happy taking care of home taking care of family so love 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 self love is coming up here for pile 6 investing yourself in yourself invest some time for yourself buy some spiritual goodies for yourself essential oils crystals take care of your health so let's see what is the angel guidance over here listen so quiet your mind beloved one and listen to our gentle reassurance that everything has been taken care of stay in a quiet and receptive state without worrying about the exact nature of your desires manifestation a quiet mind and a body hears us quickly and clearly this is our request to you listen So listen to the angels taking care of yourself with the self love you will you know increase the vibe you will raise your vibration and raising your vibration will help you to connect with the angels because they are high vibes beings so connect to the angels and when you connect them you could actually listen you could be able to hear that guidance that will come to you when you will quiet your mind a quiet mind and body hears us quickly and clearly so listen take care clear your mind be in the peace and connect with the angels so let's take a last hidden truth message to close this reading file 6 a burning personal issue requires changes change of your perspective yeah so anything that is going on right now any issues going on right now you need to change your perspective to change to see the things see in a different way see in a positive way So any issue right now coming up you have to quiet your mind you need the answer for it how to solve that or whatever the issues going on right now in your life so you need to listen quiet your mind and listen to the angels the guidance will come the answers will come the clarity will come that's what you need to do and before that indulge in self love spoil yourself So thank you thank you thank you so much pile 6 if it resonate with you please like share and subscribe to me to my channel and let me know in the comment section 
which part resonate with you thank you thank you thank you so much for all of my subscribers i already reached 100 subscribers so thank you thank you thank you so much for your love and light thank you thank you thank you so much for all of your comments bye for now